What's up everybody? Pete with Holiday Pair Tips, bringing you another pro tip. It's about 105 degrees heat index around here and the AC jobs are coming out of the woodwork. People are trying to repair the cars at home, they're taking them to shops that don't know what the heck they're doing. And here's a prime example right here. This guy bought all the parts he needed for his car, but didn't have to install it. So he took it to either, a, he said a friend at home or somebody who had some kind of jack leg shop, I don't really know. Paid all this money and the guy still don't have any AC. Let me show you what I found, check this out. So as you can see, he's got a brand new compressor. He's got a new dryer, new lines. Everything looks really good and the guy did a nice job hooking everything up, but he couldn't get any freon in the car. Now let me show you why. All right, so look right here. This line right here I'm wiggling on comes right off the receiver dryer, straight into the evaporator. It was just barely sitting in there. That's why the car wouldn't pull a vacuum and he couldn't get any freon in the car. All right guys, here's your pro tip. If you're gonna take the time and buy all the parts you need to fix your car correctly, make sure you find somebody who knows what the heck they're doing. It doesn't matter if they're in their backyard or it's a shop. Some of the best mechanics I know work out of their backyard and there's nothing wrong with that. Just find that person that can do it correctly and save yourself some time and money. All right guys, that is it for this video. I appreciate you watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Make sure you leave a comment. Tell me what kind of work you do. Tell me if you're a do-it-yourselfer. Tell me if you're a guy who has a shop or you work in your own backyard. All right, that's it for this video. Catch you later.